makes something we want to change? What makes it unsuccessful? Why doesn't it work out? Uh, Brother Hussein, do you want to take that? Uh, yeah. Uh, I think what makes it unsuccessful is because either they go too big or, like, they yeah. forget it. Forget about it. You have to be constantly reminded about it. If you, if you make, a like, a resolution, you want to change yourself. So that change, you should keep thinking about it. Otherwise, you'll just forget about it. And then, like this year, we don't know what we said last year. Yeah, that's that's why it's um, yeah, that's that's basically goes along with the you know the whole big approach. You know, you want to do something big. You want to you know, um, huge changes. You know, massive changes. That's why you know even for people like if you're reading. Somebody's like kind of loose on their namaz. They like read, okay, I read here, I read, you know. And then one day they're like, okay, I'm going to read like all of the Nophilus within one day. It's not going to happen. Maybe you're going to be able to do it one day because stuff like that, it goes according to our emotions. It's like, okay, today I'm feeling really motivated, you know. Like a guy who wakes up on a Tuesday, um, you know, after, let's say, stuffing his face all week, you know. Let's say he's like, you know, getting to the point where, you know, he doesn't go to the gym at all. And then one day he's like, okay, I'm going to go every day this week. Like, okay, that's just like something rash. Like, you know, like say at nighttime you're thinking, oh, I want to make this change. You know, I'm going to, I'm going to, you know, whatever we want to do. Like, I want to get really good at basketball. And then it's, in the day it's like, eh, you know, you know, I'm not going to, you know, I don't feel like it. Or when we're yeah, uh, shit. Like, uh, you mean the emotional spikes we have or the motivation yeah, we yeah. have all of a sudden? I read a really good quote somewhere, I believe it was in a book, that motivation is temporary, but like um, if you have a plan and like you put all emotions aside, then you can get really consistent without motivation because motivation really is temporary. You, like, you'll be really hyped and really pumped to do something one day and then you'll just be really lazy the other day. And that happens. I believe that's like uh, everybody goes through that, I guess. Yeah, like, I mean, how many times, like, realistically, guys, how many times have we gone to, like, a masjid or something, and you heard, like, a really good speech, and you're like, oh, wow. Like, even, like, for example, the other day I was, um, I went to this course at the masjid, it was about Barzakh, and, you know, the afterlife and all that. And so, you know, I was over there, I was like, wow, you know, like, every single moment matters, you know. I was like, you know, wow, this is going to change my life. And then, the next day, like, you still think about it, but it's like, it's not the same thing. It's like, okay, I understand that, but, like, you're still wasting your time, like, you know, like, say I play a video game or something. Like, it's not, it's not a sin, but at the same time, it's like, over there, I'm thinking, all right, every second counts, and now it's like, okay, here and there, you know. So I think that happens to a lot of people when you have, like, you know, like you were saying, when you go according to that feeling of motivation that, okay, something has to happen in order to make me want to change.